Well, you know, we are just hours. I guess I could say hours now away from Thanksgiving. And uh, there's a lot of turkey giveaways going on here across the Coachella Valley. So before we get into your weather, I got to talk to you about them. Food Now, Desert Hot Springs has 500 turkeys. Wow, 500 turkeys? That's a lot of turkeys out there. And also the Galilea Center uh, in Mecca has about 600 turkeys to give away. That is just a cornucopia. That is a cornucopia of turkeys out there. So if you need one, go to those localized areas. Again, Mecca and into Desert Hot Springs. Let's talk about the weather again. Cloud cover, yeah, it's moving on in. But the good news is I think we're going to get rid of the chance for shower activity. It's starting to dry out. We're seeing a little bit more of a stabilization happening in the middle and upper levels of the atmosphere. Light on the winds again. We're going to continue with that trend too and just bring on in some cloud cover. We've got a cold front low pressure system combo. I think most of the shower chances are going to stay relatively towards the coastal areas, maybe getting a little bit involved uh, with the inland areas, but once it moves on into the valley, I don't think so. I think it's really going to start to dry out. We'll see more sunshine roll onto the forecast. It's going to take some time to get here though. Cloud cover will build in the 70s. They still last though, continuing in the mid and low 70s throughout the Coachella Valley. We'll see cooler temperatures as you get out outside the valley and of course a little bit more towards the north within the valley such as desert hot springs at 71. We do have the sunshine. It's just going to take some time to get here. By Sunday we'll see more sunshine continuing into Monday and then another shot for cloud cover rolling on in to Tuesday. That is your forecast. Back to the desk.